Welcome back to Story Crypto. In this video, I'm going to show you how to cash out USDC from a phantom wallet to your bank account. And in this example, we're going to use Coinbase as our off ramp. The process will be very similar no matter which centralized exchange you use. So before we begin, it's really important with USDC or any crypto that you're cashing out to make sure you select the right network as your receive address. We're going to do two different examples in this video. You can see I have some USDC in here and then I also have some Solana. Let's click on this USDC and then let's scroll down. And if you look right here, it says network ethereum so this is usdc on ethereum you can also have usdc on solana which i'll show you in a minute after we do this first one i'm pointing this out right now and i'll continue to emphasize this throughout the video because it's critical if you send usdc to the wrong network when cashing out to coinbase or any other centralized exchange you risk losing your crypto so again make sure you verify in your wallet first what network it's on so this is usdc that i have i have twelve dollars and 93 cents of it and it's on network ethereum okay i'm logged into my Coinbase account. I'm going to click on receive crypto and I'm going to click on USDC. Receive USDC. And here's the critical part Ethereum network. Okay. So I know that's the correct network, right? I'm going to go ahead and copy this receive address and I'm going to open up my phantom wallet. And once again, I have $12.92 of usdc that again checking the network is ethereum so that matches up ethereum network ethereum network good to go so i'm going to send this usdc paste in my coinbase receive address for ethereum network usdc i'll say max amount and then i'm going to click next i'm going to confirm the send looks like it was sent successfully you can view the transaction on etherscan which is the explorer for ethereum network looks like we have success let's go back to coinbase let's close this should show up pretty quickly, although Ethereum is much slower than Solana, so you have to be a little bit patient. So then if we refresh the page, and we go to My Assets, and then we go to Cash, you'll see USDC, we now have that $12.92. That took about a minute, maybe a little bit less. Now that we have this USDC in our Coinbase account, the next step, if I want to send this to my bank account, I would probably go ahead and convert it to USD, US dollar, and just say max and place order. Successfully swapped USDC to US dollar. If I go back to my assets and then cash, you can see I now have $12.92. And then if I click on the dots over here, I can just say withdraw. And then I would just withdraw all of it to my checking account, click preview. So that would go to my checking account. So it's that easy to do it that way. Now let's go back again. Let's go to my assets. Let's open up phantom wallet. So we just did it Ethereum, right? We did USDC that was on Ethereum network. Now I want to show you how to do it with Solana USDC. Okay. So currently in this wallet, I just have Solana. Step one for the example, I'm going to swap some of this Solana to USDC. So I'll say 50%, $10 worth. I'm going to go ahead and swap now. Again, I'm swapping. You can see I'm on Solana network. And so I'm going to swap for Solana USDC, right? There is a difference. Super important to remember that. All right, so I'm gonna swap. All done, hit close. So now we have $10.27 of USDC. Let's click on it. Let's verify it's on Solana network. So network Solana, all right? So again, this is critical. If you send your USDC to the wrong network when trying to send it to Coinbase or any centralized exchange, you're gonna lose it. So verify this before you do it. Network Solana, good. So this is Solana USDC. Let's go back to Coinbase. Let's click receive crypto. And if I were to just click on this, by default, it's going to take you to USDC Ethereum. This would be wrong. We would lose that USDC if we sent it to this receive address because it's on the wrong network. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to search for USDC. Click on that. And then again, right here, it says, what should I pick? Select the same network as the platform you send from. So in this case, we have Solana USDC. So we're gonna click on Solana. Again, it's gonna give you a warning. Receiving crypto over the wrong network could mean you're losing your funds. I understand. Okay, so this is receive USDC for Solana network, which is correct in this example. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and copy that receive address. Go back to Phantom Wallet. I'm gonna click on the USDC that I wanna send to Coinbase so we can cash it out to our bank account. Just one more time, I'll verify it. So we have $10.27 of USDC. Here's the network, it's Solana. Here's the receive USDC network, it's Solana. We're good. So send, paste the Coinbase USDC Solana network, receive address there. I'll say max amount, $10.27, next. And I'm gonna say send. That was quick. Solana is much faster than Ethereum, so this should happen even quicker. View transaction. 
That's going to open up Soul Scan, which is the Explorer for Solana. You can see we have success here. Let's go back to Coinbase. Let's refresh the page. And then let's change this from crypto to cash. You can see right here, we now have that $10.27 of USDC Solana that we sent to our account. Now, if I wanna send this to my bank account, I would go over here and I would say convert to USD and I would say max and place order. Order submitted, it should happen pretty quick. Let's go ahead and refresh this. Let's go to cash. And you can see now we have all US dollars, $23.19. And I could simply now withdraw this. So you go ahead and withdraw as much as you want. I'll just say $5 and then select the bank account that you want to send it to. And then I'm going to go ahead and say preview. So we're withdrawing five US dollars. It says funds will arrive instantly to my bank account. And I'm going to say withdraw cash now. It's going to send me a text message to the phone number that you have for your Coinbase account. Go ahead, enter that. Withdrawals pending, we'll email you when it's done. And that's how you cash out USDC from a phantom wallet to Coinbase and then to your bank account. And taking a look at my bank account, you can see it was an instant transfer. We transferred $5, we got $4.45, so there were some fees involved. But the transfer of the USD from Coinbase to my bank account happened within just a minute or two. Again, main thing to remember, make sure you have the correct network. There's multiple forms of USDC. There's USDC on Ethereum. There's USDC on Solana, as well as other chains. Make sure that if you're sending USDC on Solana, you send it to the USDC Solana network receive address on Coinbase. And same thing if it's USDC on Ethereum network, make sure you send it to your Coinbase USDC Ethereum network receive address. That's the critical part about sending USDC back to Coinbase. Also, I recommend start small. If you have a ton of USDC in your Phantom wallet, don't send it all at one time. Just start with a test, small test amount. That way you can't go wrong. Then you know it works. And then you can skip up. Hopefully this was helpful. If it was, please leave a like and consider subscribing for more crypto tutorials. See you in the next one.